Hey yo everyone, this is a uh, Happy Anime Cafe Manager here with another Well walkthrough episode for a pretty game Super Paper Mario. Just scoot this up a little more. Yeah, I, I still yeah, I've neglected to get a new tripod, so I'm just gonna, gonna have to uh St uh, stack the box from my old cut that was uh, holding my la old camcorder onto the top of a, a first aid kit box. I mean, on top of a first aid box. And now I can't remember where, where the hell I'm. I mean, I know I got four, four pure hearts. I can't even remember what, what to do next. I, yeah, I have a, co a collection of my My Little Pony figures. So what? Through the first battle against Francis, TP and Mario group, TP and the Mario game grew closer. Behind the fourth door lay a whole new world that beckoned to them both. What awaited was vaster and stranger than anything they've encountered so far. In order to claim the pure heart, they would have to endure new far out trials. Chapter 4-1, Into Outer Space. Hmm, <laughs> <laughs> stars everywhere. I believe we're in outer space almost certainly. What troubles you, Mario? Ah, oh, yes, of course, we seem to be lacking Gary. You need that, don't you? Oh, oh gracious me, what am I to do? Um, well, let me see. Um, well, then, well, well, but so... No! Hey, please wake up. You're all right, aren't you? Oh, thank goodness. I don't really know how I got, got us all, all out of there. It just sort of happened. We won't last out there as we are. Perhaps we should ask Merlon's advice. I thought I was going to start the chapter right away, but... Yeah, it does make sense that... When you go into space... There's no oxygen for you to breathe. Well, that actually makes sense, but how do you explain about walking underwater? Oh ho, that was certainly quick work. You've already found the next pure heart? No, Merlon. That door led us straight into outer space. Space. Oh no, I imagine that was an unwelcome surprise. Yes, there was no air so Mario and his uh, friends couldn't breathe. What do we do? Hmm. Well, if you had a space helmet, you uh, would be all, all right, I imagine. And you have one? Of course, I don't have one. <laughs> but I imagine that even something like a space helmet would suffice. And I just so uh, happened to. Oh, blast it! What now? Oh, double blast it all! I cleaned out my shelves the other day. Yes, I had the perfect thing, but I was making space and I gave it to someone in town. To who? 
Oh, just some random boy. It seemed more convenient than recycling it. You must find that boy and explain the situation. Get back from him. Ugh, it's always something. Oh, yes. Well, I still have to have time. It's almost Christmas, everyone. Anyway, uh, I haven't, uh, I mean, I've done as much, uh, sh Christmas shopping as I c can, but... But my d dilemma is, is that... We couldn't get... Get enough for everyone. And for uh, some of the people in my uh, life, they had to, uh, They had to sh share a gift. Like, uh... A f like, I got something for a... F for a friend of mine as well, as well as a former co-worker. Yeah, I, the the uh, gift I I was gonna that I'm gonna give him and his well, wife is a Deadpool mug. Huh? Did Marlon give uh, me something like a helmet? You mean this fishbowl? Yeah, I kept Captain Gills here in the cup, but when he gets got too big for it. Yeah, that's why I got a real happy when I got this fishbowl. Thing is now, the captain got so big the bowl got too small for him. Hey, I know, maybe you could find a nice place to set Captain Gills free for me. Captain deserves freedom, then you get gets the fishbowl. That's a good, huh? Hmm, but where can he go? I want to know that he'll be nearby at all times. You guys to help me. You got the goldfish bowl. You can't use it yet. Find a place to release the fish. I didn't ex expect a bo some random bo boy to use a space helmet as a fish bowl, but but it, it is pretty pretty cl clever. Now that's what I call recycling. What about this fountain? Okay, so I can't release it here. I have to have one other... There's another fountain? Anyway, as for, for my cousins, I got them each a Christmas uh, stocking with some good goodies inside. And also got them a, a mandatory uh, gift uh, that the both of them could enjoy. I got them a, co a copy of Super Mario 3D World for Wii U. They seem to enjoy it. Yeah, they got to open their present early and they seem really seem to enjoy it. This looks like a good place to release the captain release the goldfish here. Uh, that's why I th thought the boy would won't. I mean that's what I thought the uh, game would uh, have me do. Now that the fishbowl is empty, that means you could use this use it as a space helmet. Uh. Now we can go to space. So let's head back to that door. Anyway, uh, I thought about going going back to the pit of a hundred trials, but 
I haven't built a, built up enough uh, skill. Did you just plow through it through as on my current level? Therefore, I'm gonna wait until I get a little bit further to just. Like until uh, Mario's attacks get stronger. Or the entire team's attacks get stronger, as well as. Capturing some car. Capturing enemies in a card. I use a helmet. It's dangerous to head into space all willy nilly, you know. Please put the helmet on. It's not like being in water, you know. Please, I must insist you put the helmet on. So let me get this clear. You enjoy not breathing? Please put the helmet on. <laughs> I fail to see the wisdom, I beg of you, while your brain works. Put the helmet on. If you don't, you have you. Do you have any idea what your fate will be? Be awful. Do you want that? My mind is fully boggled. You want want to not breathe? <laughs> truly, you truly sure? Oh, who is this? Who is stupider, you or me, for listening to you? No more. Goodbye. <laughs> Uh, I swear I didn't pl plan that. I just want to see see where this goes. It's like, what? Well, why give me the option? What well, when you when developers want you to put the helmet on? I mean, do they think we're illiterate or something? I guess this is it. I mean, for a company that. That's tough. Whose target audience is chill children? I don't feel that this uh, game is made for kids. It... Well, what do you think? You can breathe now. Very well. Let's go then. The pure heart is somewhere in this sea of stars. Wow, this is weird. I guess I can't go down further from here. SOS. just resisted to putting on the helmet. Like, put on the fucking helmet. Okay, good. Game is over now. You suck. That's where the SOS signal is coming from. Oh, I'm supposed to do this. 
Let's head out and search for the next pure heart. There's something here. What in the world is this? Why was it? Why was this hitting here? Hmm. This is a spaceship. It looks rather like. Morning, Scrap! Oh dear, who are you? An alien? An alien, perhaps? You're the ones looking for a horn of pure heart, Scrapple? Hmm, cuter than I thought. How do you know about the pure heart and about us? Are you allied with Count Black? I demand answers. No, no scary faces. You can call me Squirps. I'm your captain, Squirp. And if you want the pure heart, we need to work together. Squirp. Whatever you mean, please explain yourself. Squirps can't tell you much now, but you must trust Squirps. Now, follow me, Squeaks. We won't be doing that, we just... Squaw! You, you need a captain. You are the space grunt now, and that is the only rule. Your only response should be yes sir and gotcha. Understand, Squirkle? Yes sir or gotcha. Squeak, yeah, squeak, squeak, squeak. Looks like you understand your place. Squirk. Are you okay with this? If you say so. Great, let's get ready then. Squark formation, school goal. We'll squark directly to the pure heart. It's like warping, except Squirps invented it. In order to squark, we'll need a lot of energy. Squark. You're all burning with power up power, right? You must give it the squarks. Press A to give Squirps your power up power. Pre press and hold. Hold A until you think you've built up enough power up, then release. Success! And here we go. Squawk! even close to our destination. Oops! Is that all the power up you power you have, Squirt? Good for nothing, Space Grunt. Squirts was an idiot for thinking you had more. Well good for nothings have their own good for nothing ways of moving squack. There's a there's a way, ways to go before you reach the pure art. You must space swim. Use two to shoot enemies with my squirt squirt beam. Squirt fire space grunt. Charge! Oh, cool. The honey jar. Star. 
so I've come across an asteroid field. Yeah, the, the developers uh, probably thought of this. They probably th thought I'm going to just uh, spam the, the black, the scorp laser. switch to any other character since I'm gonna be in the 2 2d playing playing the whole time well thanks for watching until next time to be continued baby